today I have GMC Terran 2009 and the customer complain is a lack of power as well as the check engine and traction control light is being on and if I want to accelerate this throttle pedal it won't rev up as we can see here the maximum RPM is 25 let's hook up scan tool and see what we have as we can see here P2101 which indicate control module with throttle actuator position performance current disease and the second one 2119 throttle closed position performance obviously we have trouble with the throttle body let's go to live data and check the TP sensor 1 and TP sensor 2 this is the TP sensor 1 the voltage is 3.5 almost but it's fluctuating it goes up and down it should be steady and if we check the TP sensor disagree it says yes it should say it should say no okay my next move is to check the wiring schematic and locate the TP sensor 1 it's located at pin number 2 at this rotor body okay and at the right of this schematic we can see the connector of this rotor body this is 1 and this is 2 and the number 2 is TP1 or TPS1 signal what should I do now is to perform and through this test I will back probe the green wire number two and measure the voltage with the ignition on okay now the reading is 4.2 volt and steady let's bring the scan tool and compare this reading to what the ECM or engine control module will see okay right now we have 4.2321 it goes up and down this indicates that the engine control module driver does not read the data correctly this means we have engine control module failure we need to replace no need to do any intrusive test or any more testing like power and ground etc the engine control module is located near the battery I will call for new ECM and next we will see the result okay now I am on the next day unfortunately I didn't found a new ECM in our store but I brought a used one this is the old one I marked and this is the used one I hope this used ECM fixed this car okay now I will uh, install it to the vehicle and perform some programming and after that we can check if this ECM fixed this vehicle For sure we have to perform a theft theft so the vehicle can run okay all the programming event has been done now I did not declare any code I just finished programming and I want to clear all the TC first then I will check the data if it's still fluctuating up and down We have four DTCs. All the DTCs is due to the pro uh, to, uh, due to programming event. I don't care about all these DTC. I will clear all the DTCs. And why? And what I am concerned of is the data. Does the TP sensor one 
still fluctuating goes up on down and or it's steady now let's see this together zero dtc back back to data display tag data and here we go wow the p sensor one is 0 0.76 and the steady and the tepe sensors disagree it says no before we replace the ECM it was yes we have a fix but just to make sure and before we deliver the car to the customer I just want to go for ride and check if everything is correct now I will now the engine is running and revving up perfectly let's go for ride and see how this vehicle react on the road it look very perfect very powerful no more lack of power the only light is flashing is the fuel the car is empty it needs fuel okay um, I will check if there is any other DTCs and the vehicle will be ready to deliver to the customer refresh okay every time you want to build a vehicle you have to wait even you, you are using a genuine scan tool 2009 GMC it's the powertrain 2.45 speed engine control module diagnosis trouble code data displays let's see if we have DTCs I don't know and uh, bingo no DTC great let's go back to the data final check on the tag data and see the tp sensor if it yes great it's steady and not fluctuating perfect now the vehicle is uh, finished is fixed and ready to deliver it back to the customer this used ECM fixed this vehicle perfect Thanks for watching and I hope this video found informational and please don't forget to subscribe and share. Bye bye.